Today we're going to learn about something called digraphs. Digraphs are two letters that are put together and they make a special sound. So up until this point when we've reviewed our sounds and our, our letters, we've done one letter making one sound with the exception of QU, right? We know QU says qu, like in queen. But all of our other letters, we have one letter and one sound. Today we're going to learn digraphs, which are two letters that make one sound. So for example, over here I have these two letters, CH. If we were thinking about what CH say, we would think K, right? So maybe if we were trying to tap out this word, we might say K, I, N, K, N. But that's not how you do that because CH is actually a digraph. And CH makes a special sound that goes like this. Ch. Can everyone try that? Ch. Good job. So CH is a digraph and it says ch, which is just one sound. So if you wanted to tap out this word, you would say ch, e, n, chin. I'll show you the rest of the digraphs that we're learning. SH says sh, CK says k, WH says w, and TH says v. So sometimes digraphs can be found at the beginning of the word, sometimes at the end of a word, and sometimes they can be found at both. So for example, CH can be found at both. So we can have CH like in chin at the beginning of a word, or we can have it in the word cheese or children. But then we can also have CH at the end of a word, like itch or watch. So CH can be at the beginning or the end of a word. SH, which says sh, can also be at the beginning or the end of a word. So in this picture, we see a ship. We can say shell. We can say she. And sometimes it can be at the end of a word, like fish or brush or wish. So we can find the digraph SH in both beginning and end of words. CK we would usually find at the end of a word. So for example, sock, tuck, luck. We would see CK at the end of the word and both of these say k and when you put it together, it's just the same thing. It's just k. WH we would find at the beginning of a word. So this is a whistle. We would see it at a lot of sight words start with WH like where, what, when. So we would see WH, w at the beginning of a word. And then TH we would see at the beginning or the end of a word. So over here we see a thumb. It's at the beginning of the word, thumb. But then we might see the word with, and that would have the TH at the end. So those are our digraphs. Before we review the cards, I just wanna show you something Sometimes when we're in school, when we tap out our words, we use, sometimes we write them in sound boxes, right? So say I was going to write the word chin. Ch, in. And I wanted to put boxes around this. I wouldn't put a different box for each letter because when we put the boxes there for sounds. So if we were in school, we would show you with our magnets that we put the sounds inside of, but I'm just gonna draw the box. So you, this whole digraph of CH would be in its own box because it's one sound. Ch, I, N. If I was going to tap it out, it would still be three finger taps because it's still three sounds. Ch, I, N, chin, right? I wouldn't do it ch, I, N, or it, mm, that wouldn't make any sense. So remember, that's just one sound. If I had the word wish, it's the same thing. The W, w is one sound. The I, the I is one sound. And then the SH is one sound. Shh. 
So it would get one box. So the same thing, I could tap this out also. Wish, w, i, sh, wish. So I just want you to notice that. Um, diagraphs make one sound. It would be one box. It would be one tap, w, i, sh, okay? Now I'm gonna erase this and then look back at our cards again so that we can go through the, the proper way to do our sound drill. So let's, let me go through it first, then I want you to try and do it with me, and then I want you to try and do it on your own. So we have CH, chin, ch, SH, ship, sh, CK, sock, k, WH, whistle, w. TH, thumb, th. Good job. Now let's go through them again, and I want you to try to do it with me, okay? TH, thumb, th. WH, whistle, w. CK, sock, k. SH, ship. Sh. CH, chin, ch. Okay, now I want you to try it on your own. Great job.